Oh my god! Bro! Do we have room for this shit? Uh, we just packed, yeah, we just packed. Is it good? Yeah, it should be good, honestly. Alright, we're packing light. I have no idea if I'm focused. I am not. Oh my god. We're ready to go. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually put the gas. Oh wait! Oh oh no! You're good. Give it a shot. Very. Oh, we're gonna hurricane. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> That's not gonna be a disaster. Dong dong. What's that for? Because <laughs> the sound card's just fucking obliterated my camera <laughs> or my computer. That's yeah. that's how we're gonna t sound uh, hear the video when I edit it. Is Literally we, plug it in and just be like. Uh, that's right, how I did right, it, right. That's how I did it in uh, fucking Florence. Really? Yeah, I just ran that speaker. I don't even I just remember it, that at all. And it's honestly. in the seat pocket in front of me in the back seat. So when I'm doing it, when it sounded like it was coming out of my computer, it was actually coming out of the seat back. It Whatever was... works, man. Simple as that, honestly. <laughs> it is nearing 12:30 in the morning, and we are on I-20, coming up close on the Louisiana border right now. Uh, about an hour ago, uh, Hurricane Michael was definitely looking pretty intense, uh, but in the past hour, it's had some serious intensification. Absolutely beastly. Well, we don't. It's gonna. Yeah, if we get it into approximately this, is that at the approximately? It's just a little lower. I was gonna this say you can, right fit, you can fit yeah, a little bit more in there. Yeah. 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 Just trying to make every drip don't, count. Don't at this build point. up so all the times that you did it. Yeah. All right. I think we're ready. All right. Let's drive. I'll drive. Perfect. Perfect. We're on our way to chase this historical hurricane. This is by far. Probably the strongest hurricane to hit the Florida Panhandle ever. 940 millibars and dropping. And dropping. And she's my and he's a uh, he's making a run for Cat 5, so we don't know. It might be Cat 5 by the time we get there. Well, we are gonna get there right about the time he gets on shore. We're cutting this close. This is insane. This is uh, actually pretty, uh, pretty if we, stupid. If we pull this off, this is actually gonna be impressive. Uh, dude, and back home for dinner. Back home <laughs> Let's for dinner. Do it. Back home for the weekend. Oh my God. I'll be ready. Well, it is yeah, there's, just there's after right 7.30 in the morning, and we are on I-10 in Mobile, Alabama, just coming into the city right now. We are going to be cutting it extremely close for Hurricane Michael here. Uh, should be arriving in Panama City Beach right around 10.30, uh, maybe a little earlier or a little later, depending on how risky we want to be here. Um, yeah, at this point, it's looking like a high-end Category 4, possibly a low-end Category 5 landfall. It's going to be extreme, to say the least. 8.13 a.m., and we've officially crossed the Florida state line. Nerves are starting to run tense. Uh, the uh, outer bands of Hurricane Michael are finally coming short and affecting the state of Florida. Why don't, you, uh, why don't you explain what just happened to us on the highway there? Go ahead. Well, um, we got pulled over for speeding in a hurricane. Yeah. And uh, got a ticket for well, apparently we uh, driving we, faster we drove, than the conditions allow. I mean, okay, we might have been speeding. That's fine. But we drove up right behind a state trooper, and he just did not like that too much at all. So he pulled us over for speeding, driving with our hazards, and then tailgating, which is kind of weird because we never really tailgated him. We kind of just rolled up behind him and then backed off and then he just like got right behind us so held us up for probably about 10 minutes which is not good can't stop us making well, we're it. still going we're, we're just turning we just got off of i-10 turning south you're, you're seeing towards, a, a good uh, example of poor life decisions right here very much so very sleep poor. deprived poor life decisions too yes but uh we just got off of i-10 we're heading south towards uh, so Panama so. City Beach so. no, nothing says like a photogenic hurricane like one where yeah. the car windows are completely Clogged over so that oh, my yeah. uh, camera that you see right there is going to be useful. It's going to be fantastic. Let's just, you know, this thing is going to hit category five. And we're just going to be with the windows down in the car trying to shoot out. Yeah, it. it's uh, this, the thing is, is that uh, the air conditioning doesn't work in the car, so 
the windows on the inside have been really tough to defrost unless we have the heater on, and the heater is not feeling too good. So, good news though, I remember to bring the pillow that I bought during foreign. So, riding in comfort. Speaking of comfort, let's uh, see how they're doing up front. I'm tired. I'm hungry. I gotta pee. Are we there yet? <laughs> no, uh, not the window. Evan, how you feeling, man? Like, be honest. Um. 100%. Honestly, at this point, man, uh, knowing the fact that 25,000 plus people haven't left uh, Panama City Beach at this point, um, and the hurricane is really bordering on a Category 5, we're looking at a uh, possible 14-foot storm surge and at least 145 mile an hour sustained winds. I'm very nervous uh, for the people of Panama City Beach. Um, my gut is in knots right now. But I'm just ready to get to a safe place after that little uh, mishap back there and, uh, you know, get ready to ride this out in a safe manner for sure. Jason, how do you feel, buddy? Today's done. <laughs> <laughs> I got family where all three of their homes are in the, uh, either the mandatory zone A or voluntary zone D. So hopefully uh, they still have a place to live. One of them. Uh, the one who's in zone A who lives on the water, she, in the last six months, just moved here from Marco Island, where her house there that she was living in at the time got hit by Irma. So she's batting uh, two for two right now for her living in Florida. Ears are 
So close, we're almost out of it, guys. The eyes are already over the highway that way. They're with the gas, I smell it. Yeah, that's the gas. Fuck. I should have got out there when we could. No way, dude. Turn the car off. There's no way we can ride this out again. Oh, oh, there it goes. Shit. There it goes. We gotta do something. Oh. Quick. Turn it around. window shot. shift so we're on the very 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 cusp of it everyone stay down have an ending at some point we got to be in this thing there we go oh it's really lightening up behind us keep your windows down but it's really lightening up behind us like the wind is dying substantially behind us we're almost tropical storm force we're coming out of it Oh my gosh, we're in the eye. Oh my see god. Yeah, you can see almost clear skies right above go, us. We need to go to that field, man. Yeah. Hold on. We need to go to that field. I need to make sure that I'm going to clear the front of the car. My battery might be dying. On your car? Yeah. Turn it on. Turn it on. We're good. Go ahead and start it. Are we stuck here? Yeah, I won't start. We're fucking stuck here. Oh no. We gotta get out of here. One of the two. How? How? We gotta get in the bank. Call somebody. 
We gotta get in the base. We gotta, we gotta walk into the base. What the fuck? We have everything here. Call Brett. Call Brett. Call Brett. I don't have signal. Call Brett. Do you have signal? There's no cell service, dude. All right, we gotta get somewhere. Call Brett. There's no fucking. He's got. Cell he's signal. got cell signal. He's got cell signal. I don't have his number. Here, here, here. We just rode out a category five hurricane in the dumbest fucking place possible. I don't know how we are alive right now. Let's get out of this. Let's go in the base, please. Here's the number. To where though? I don't know, but we can at least maybe try to get in a building that has protection. I'm down. into that fucking building and we are getting into the interior most fucking room you got it Doors are locked. This is not viable. Okay, go to the building next door. I can probably get these doors Thunder in the eye wall right now. Complete devastation as far as the eye can see. And yet, somehow, it's perfectly sunny and calm. We shouldn't have survived. We shouldn't have survived that. We're all alive. We're in the eye right now. We're in the eye. You got a flat. As well. I got two flats. So we're screwed on that. I got us in the hallway in this building if we need to get deeper in the building. Alright. We're in the Air Force base. We had no choice. The car got totaled. We're stuck here until the eye passes. I'm fucking thirsty, man. You didn't have to bring water, did you? Jason, we shouldn't have survived that, man. We shouldn't have survived that, but we did. Glad we did. I'm gonna kick Bart's ass. I'm kicking Bart's ass so hard, man. Yeah. <sighs> Sorry about your car, man. Sorry, are you alive? We're alive. That's all that matters. We do have round two coming, but we do have uh, at least a sturdy shelter here in the Air Force Base. At least we hope so. Just gonna document some of this damage, though. Air Force Base has been completely demolished. This is the building we're gonna hang out in. We're gonna really hope that it can withstand the rest of the hurricane. The buildings are totally destroyed. Fuck. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. It's the stadium effect. It's the stadium effect. I feel like I'm gonna vomit. I'm extremely thirsty. I should have brought a water and I didn't. Oh my goodness. Way too much time. Oh, Jesus. I hope fucking Bart's okay, dude. Jesus Christ, Bart. <laughs> coming off, the whole truck is open. Back glass blown out. Two flat tires. Honda Civic that uh, apparently doesn't want to give up. Yeah. All right, who wants a peanut butter, cinnamon raisin? Uh, maybe not right now. I got it.
So we don't we can just stack shit however we want in there. Wow. That's good. This is real good. It's, it's getting right. there. It's she's good. better than she's ever been, honestly, I yeah. think, you know. They need his now it's got character. Yeah. <laughs> a lot it's of character. Some spikes to the front of it. <laughs> yeah, it's true. It's like in a foreign uh Joe fucking steering wheel from Fury Road. Yeah, check this, this out real quick, Marcus. We could just shave off the roof and just go. That's right. <laughs> One a day. This is what a flying projectile will do to your tire. Yep. And that was one of two. I don't know how this thing's ready to go, but we're gonna make it back to Dallas. Oh my gosh. Yep. Just gotta do a little bit of a cleaning in the back seat. Alright, here, pop that trunk again. And clear out some of this window. Sorry, sorry. Against all odds, we brought it back home. I have no idea how. And we got a cool cloud show. And we have an amazing Kill display me. out here, man. Undulatus asperatus. Look over there, dude. Oh my that god. That looks fake like a painting. This whole sky looks like it's just been painted by a fucking school kid. But it made it! <laughs> 